Yo, 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 what is up Halo community? I hope you're all having a fantastic day. And today we're going to be looking at some Season 3 maps that just got leaked by Serezio. Cer and yeah, so he leaked two maps, the first map being Cataract and the second map being Solitude. So by the looks of it, it seems like it's one arena map and one BTB map, just like in Season 2 when we had uh, Catalyst arena map and then we had Breaker the BTB map. So it seems like they're going to be keeping that format throughout all the seasons um, so yeah I believe this is one arena map and one BTB map so let's go ahead and take a look at these new maps and then I'll talk about uh, some of the issues I have with these maps now I do want to say that of course this is like early stuff so you can't expect it to look exactly like this but yeah let's take a look at them here so we got cataract here and yeah it seems to be some kind of like UNSC uh, base I'm not entirely sure where it is. It looks like it's in a cave or something. It's like a weird cave system thing. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Um, there's like a lot of verticality. You know, there's a lot of places you could like jump up and stuff. It seems like it's a pretty big map. I'm not really sure whether this is a BTB map or an arena map. I would go with arena map, but it's like one of those weird arena maps like launch site where it's like not really a big team battle map, but it's not really an arena map either. So it's like, I don't know. It's kind of like a mix of the two is what it seems like anyways. So that is the first map which is cataract now let's take a look at solitude which was also leaked by serezio and this one actually the other one looks like it's in some kind of like underground transit system for uh cataract this is the one that looks like it's in some kind of cave and so this one is called solitude and i'm gonna assume this is the big big team battle map um yeah this one's a lot bigger so you got some kind of like cave system kind of thing and i don't know man this one seems a little little odd uh there's like a lot of stairs and stuff now remember this is all like early stuff so there's not much to it i guess right now but uh i don't know it looks pretty pretty meh in my opinion all right so now that we looked at the two new leaked maps that are apparently going to be coming out in season three i actually want to go ahead and give you guys my thoughts about it and yeah, there's some issues I have with these maps. So one is that they, they both seem to be UNSC maps. Um, who knows? Maybe they'll change, but I doubt it because I know 343 really loves UNSC maps for whatever reason. Uh, like UNSC maps are not bad, but like we get so many UNSC maps. It's crazy. Like we get like, uh, you know, we get like human facilities and all that stuff. We never get like some cool like banished map or covenant map this goes back all the way to like i think halo 4 like all we get is mostly unsc maps i hope we just see more variety in the future but so far yeah i'm not a huge fan of it being more like unsc themed and all that kind of stuff now my second issue with this is that these do look like forge maps i think i believe i saw somewhere on twitter i honestly completely forgot i'll probably put the post up if i find it but uh, I believe someone said that these were made by 343 and the Forge Council members. Um, if you don't know what the Forge Council members are, they're basically people who uh, they're basically people who uh, play tested Forge early or something. Um, and yeah, they got like the full you know the full Forge release and they're testing it early. And so they collaborated with 343 and made these maps. Um, and I don't know, man. I feel like that's like I don't mind Forge maps. Obviously, I don't mind Forge maps coming to like matchmaking. I think that'd be a great idea especially with the lack of maps that we've been getting but like from 343 what i want from 343 is developer made maps i want developer stuff that only developers can mostly make you know forge maps forge is great all that but i i just think that 343 should be the ones putting out uh you know 343 dev maps and stuff like that or maybe forge is just this incredible that or i don't even know it it because it does almost look developer made i mean i could still tell it was like forge i'm guessing it's forge or maybe it is a developer made map like entirely i don't know uh but yeah people said it was like a forge council members and the developers so i'm not entirely sure but uh yeah i just hope this doesn't like fill in the gap of like you know just not having dev maps and stuff like i i don't want it to do that i want like dev maps from 343 uh but in the current situation that we're in i just don't know if they can even produce maps so like at this point it's like whatever i'll take it i guess i just want like actual maps from like 343 is what i'm saying um and then we could have like a community playlist or something and then we like throw in the forge maps and stuff but uh that's just my take on it maybe it's a hot take i don't know but yeah that's my issues with these maps that we're seeing so far of course they are early release so uh maybe they will look a lot more developer made if that makes sense 
uh, once they actually come out because these are like early leaks so we do got to keep that in mind so those are the two maps that have been leaked by seracio go ahead and check them out subscribe to his channel uh yeah he leaks a ton of stuff pretty cool let me know what you guys think personally i think i don't know man i mean they're just i don't know they just kind of like lack the flair granted they once again they're early i know i keep saying this but i, I constantly kind of have to remind myself as well <laughs> that they're early builds right but i don't know man i feel like a lot of the maps in infinite just kind of lack that flair to it that halo has um it's kind of hard to describe honestly so yeah let me know what you guys think uh down below and of course consider subscribing and liking the video i would really appreciate that we're closing in on 800 i think we can get there if you guys could do me a solid help me out there i'd really appreciate it with that being said i'll see you guys on the next one thanks for watching peace